Welcome to the stream. It's my first day of uh, break, so I'm done for the year with work. It's relieving. I'm still tired from today, but nah, that's it. So, huh, this is marked with a star now, but I'm not technically done. Um, there's still a few stages left. Which, I mean, you would think that what I went through is as hard as it gets, but I don't know. So, I got Bowser's Castle, I have the new stage that appeared yesterday, and I have that other stage that I've been avoiding, so... I guess I'll do the stage I've been avoiding. As I did have fun yesterday, so... I guess it's fine if I don't have so much fun today. Probably gonna need every single life I have here. Alright, there we go. So, I mean, stuff to talk about aside from not having to work for the rest of the year. The Game Awards were on today, and there were a few things I got announced that I'm looking forward to. Um, particularly the new game from the Celeste developers, and then Hades is getting a sequel, which is cool. Um, Dead Cells content update, which is going to cross over with Castlevania, one of my favorite franchises, so... Aside from that, uh, yeah. That's pretty much what I got out of it. You know, I'm not, I'm not gonna talk about the elephant in the room when it comes to that event. But, yeah. <laughs> Let's just say... Someone dropped the ball. Anyway, this is why I was avoiding this stage. So, I, I have the right to change my mind. If I'm really hating it this much, I'll go to the other stage. But I feel like I should attempt to make progress here. This might be a case of I need to watch what you do here. as this is probably something highly specific. Okay, well... I mean, at least it gives me that kindness. These kind of stages are an acquired taste for sure. But yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm down to the final four stages here, so... Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how it works, is I need to drop and then jump across. I'm gonna give it ten minutes. If in ten minutes I don't progress... Uh, I'm straight up looking it up. <laughs> I, I don't care. If this was back in the days of Mario Maker, I, I would skip this stage and be like to the person, listen, not my thing, sorry. Just, I'm not gonna have fun with this. And it's gonna be notable. And this is probably the case here, except stubbornness would be making me want to finish this. But yeah, I don't care. Like, uh, there was a section in the castle last time where I just... I wasn't about to hit my head against that brick wall for two hours. So I, I 
straight up did a play-by-play. So yeah, likely that's gonna happen today. <laughs> uh, it's alright. What? How? <laughs> what? How does going to the... How did that kill me? I'm, I'm hanging to the left here. And it didn't kill me. I somehow clipped Mario into the wall, into the left. Okay. This is a reset pipe, isn't it? Yeah. chosen something different to this, you know, but I'm I'm bent on finishing this before the year wraps up. And then I can move on to just playing chill stuff for a while. I think this is the only remaining difficult game I have to play. And then I'm free. Oh, this this is not fun. This is not fun in the slightest. Okay, I I gave it the sporting chance. <laughs> What's the name of this stage? Um, play by play it is. I'm not about to sit here for two hours figuring this out. It's called disarray. Okay. I thought my party disarray. And there it is. Okay, I'm just gonna see. So let's see how they do it. I'm watching this in the background right now. Um, so they throw the shell up. No, they don't. They keep the shell. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, I hate- I hate this already. Okay, so... I mean, I'll- long story short... That platform they kinda use as a barricade. Okay, thankfully it remembers. This is going to suck. <laughs> I'm gonna be here for a while. <sighs> Alright, I've already messed it up. Reset. They take the shell with them, so I'm pretty sure you have to take the shell with you. So what they do, and I'm not sure how to do this, but basically they they position it here. Wait, too far. But I might have to watch it a couple times. But that's what they do. 
Also, this is useful. I can kind of... Oh, okay. <laughs> Never mind. Alright, that was actually straightforward. I guess it's... No, but then how do I... <sighs> no, hang on. I'm watching this. How do they do it? They... Step on it and then just run down. Okay. Too far. This is gonna be one of these things where I, I will get it eventually and then be able to do it, but it's just... It's going to be annoying up until that point. That messed me up. And then... Oh. Okay, okay. If, it's, if it's like that, like, I can see myself... Doing it more reliably. Okay. Dude. Okay. S pausing it. <laughs> now what? I don't. I don't care if this is a play-by-play. -play. I really don't. So jump across. It's a blind leap of faith. Okay, and then there's a way to get a dragon coin. Alright, pausing it there. Alright. So this is a blind leap of faith. Okay, and then here. Okay. <laughs> pausing it again. I don't want to spend two hours on the stage. Right, so... Okay. I'm probably gonna die here, but the move is get here, and then I have to Oh god. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't care. So what do they do? They just follow the coin path. Okay. But there's a checkpoint already, so that's nice. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay. I'm not going to look this up because this feels straightforward. Uh... What? <laughs> what do you mean? What am I supposed to do here? Ugh. I'm going to hate the answer to this. What is it? Okay, so... Hold on. That's quite the maneuver. Yeah, I'm not- I'm not gonna get this one anytime soon, so... I don't know, man, like... This, these sort of stages are, are on point with people that just enjoy extreme pain in their sex life. It's just that, that much of an acquired taste, I think. I mean, I'm not knocking that stuff, you know, whatever you're into, you're into, right? But, like, the majority of people aren't into that. Okay. <laughs> Jeez. Wait, but like... Ugh. I'm sorry. Oh no, but, okay, that's... Yeah. Ugh, man. Hmm. 
These are the only kind of stages I'm gonna do this on. Okay, most likely going to die here. Unless I can see how they do. You know what, I'm gonna watch it. <laughs> Stand on the edge and just walk in and walk back out. Okay, okay. Stand on the edge. Walk in. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Um, cool, so... Oh my god. <laughs> that, that was skill. I didn't watch from that point, but... I'm supposed to take a shot with me as well, so that was a pure fluke. Okay, so you go down, walk across, arrow, and then there's gonna be a thing. Okay. Oh, you don't need it, but okay. Wait, what, huh? It didn't work. Oh, this is cursed. Okay, no, I, I, <laughs> I hate this. How do they do it? So it comes back down, and then... But that's not what mine's doing. So in the video, there's there's a window where I can walk across, but the, there isn't here. Like, it's overlapping. What's supposed to happen is... At this point, I'm supposed to be able to walk across, but I can't. Okay, can, can I... Yeah, that's what was supposed to happen. Okay, well... Maybe because I took too long, I don't know. that I have to do this again. Okay. <laughs> okay. See, that right there, that's how it's supposed to go. Okay, see, that's better. No! <laughs> I was almost scared that I would have to play another difficult game as well, because for a moment at the Game Awards, there was a... A brief moment where uh, Crash Bandicoot came out onto the stage. And I was convinced, oh shit, they're going to announce another Crash Bandicoot game. I'm going to have to put myself through it. But thankfully it wasn't. It w It's like some battle royale Crash Bandicoot game. And it just looks like something that's just going to be pretty much for kids. And it's just going to be riddled with microtransactions. So it was an, Im an immediate no thank you. So, false alarm. <laughs> At least this part is more fair than the start. I feel like the start was something that just sucked. This is less horrible. Still not a fan of it, but at the very least I can do 
five seconds of the stage. Who finds this fun, honestly? Uh, I'm aware, like, I I'm listening to myself. I'm the one- I'm only the one playing it. Maybe crouch jumping will help. <laughs> Maybe it did. Maybe it didn't. <laughs> Ah, oh, crap, it's out of sync. Okay, I'm just gonna have to wait for the opening again. It's not giving me that window where I can run through it. It needs to be... I'll know it when I see it. Oh, all right. This is helpful. To beat this level, you should be big and keep the mushroom in the item box. Oh my god, I almost bricked it. <laughs> I almost walked into the plat. Okay, um... Ugh. And that's, that's, is this a reset? This is a reset. Okay. I see. The heck? How have I already used 30 lives? I just noticed that. Oh god. <laughs> what was that? Wait, but but now I'm not big. Or is that the intent? Like I'm ugh. Okay. But what? I, I, I... Cool stage. When the level designers were making this, they just wanted to go for maximum intuition, you know? Just intuitive as fuck. Miyamoto would be proud. Okay, and now I made it through somehow? I don't understand what I did differently. This is why I was avoiding this stage, I could tell. Okay. Just 
have a feeling. Oh god, what is this? <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna go get the coin first, because that's going to be a problem. Otherwise. Don't worry about this, let's just sort this out first. Don't need to do that again. And now this is the part where I watch the video and see what I need to do. Alright, so you're supposed to be small here. So, it looks like I'm correct. You do do this. And apparently you drop down. Okay, hang on. So when it drops, you need to race it by the looks of it. Okay. I'm probably gonna die here. <laughs> okay, I got it. <laughs> this, this stage, dude, it's, it's so stressful. Um, is there anything- wait, that's not in- okay, you know what, it doesn't matter. I'm just gonna die here. I was just curious what this was, anyway. This part here, um, it's in the footage. There's like a, a particular part that you can go access this footage to see what to do anyway. Okay, so bounce up and wait for it. Okay, got it. Otherwise I'd have to be const- Constantly back and forth. Oh no, come on. What do you mean? Okay. Oh, this is horrible. <laughs> this is horrible. Yeah, what a fun stage. safe here. Now what? Same move again. Okay. But this is the part where I need to keep the mushroom now, I think. So now this is the part where I need to watch carefully. Oh, okay, never mind. So, damage boost it. go to the right. Okay. Damage boosts through it, go to the right. Okay, there's a Yoshi up there. And then come back. Or it's just gonna kill me while I'm waiting, that's cool. Yeah, that's, that's fine. <laughs> there's, there's no way I would have put all this together in a reasonable time frame. 
Like, I'm, I'm saving myself multiple hours of work here. hatch and then they make it eat that oh I see that's why you have to come here okay hang on otherwise it doesn't hatch right so ha hang on how do they do this because it seems like they yeet the Yoshi and then they grab it without getting stuck up there. Wait, but it's not there anymore. Hang on. Oh, now it is. Okay. I'm, gonna, I'm like gonna get myself stuck there. I can feel it. I'm not going to make any assumptions. I'm pretty sure this is what I need to do. Okay, yep. It, they didn't eat a bullet bill, so I'm not eating the bullet bill. Okay, eat the flower next. Or die! <laughs> oh, they did eat the bullet bill. I could have saved time. Damn it. Okay. Alright, well, now I know. For next time. That wasn't supposed to happen, the bullet bill. Crap. Um. I gotta watch my lives as well. This is kind of rude. <laughs> Why don't they just let me reset? Actually, the worst. Wait, can't I just? Would it shoot again? No, I guess not. Oh god. Okay, so hold up. Let's see what we have to do. We got the fire flower. And then we have to ditch Yoshi. Okay. Watching it again. Because this seems very specific. These are very careful walks here. Okay. Yeah, I, f I fucked it. I knew it. I was like, this is gonna this is gonna mess me up. So I'm not big here, which means I've, I've ruined it. Or maybe I haven't. Hang on.
Okay. Oh my god. Okay, hold up. <laughs> hold up. <laughs> this is not how it's supposed to go, but I got it done anyway. Pure fluke. Okay, so they they do this. They shrink themselves because they have to. Oh, I hate this. Okay, so... I'm probably gonna get this wrong. I've got it wrong. I think I can reset it, thankfully. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good stuff. Just die. The dragon coins have been collected, so that's nice. But I need to end up with a mushroom at this point. So it's like, there we go, okay. So you got it, and then you run in. And then I have to do it again. Okay, same thing. But this time it's, ugh, right. Oh, okay. I, I seen it. Wow. <laughs> Let's try. Okay. Okay, so here. Hand the camera across. Get it. And there's the check at the end. There's a there's a solid block, so if you're tiny, you're gonna walk into the lava. Cool, dumb stage is done. <laughs> I don't care. like the name of this. Alright. Oh no. <sighs> why? Why, why, why is this my fate today? Just... Why? Yeah, I, perfectly, yep. Yep, see, I, I get it, that means death. Things that are traditionally a block tile, if they're dark, it, it means death. Um, one sec. Cake or death? <laughs> is that a question or is that a statement? Also, hey Judy. Um, this is what I want to see. So I can unlock this stuff now. Okay, pixel perfect. So let's see the movie. Okay. Are you, are, you, are you kidding me? 
Oh, we are 100% doing this. There's even a checkpoint. You can go... No, come on. Really? What's the point of this stage? That's just... That's just them acknowledging that this stage sucks. <laughs> what do you mean? That's why there's two of them. I think one of them is... Just if you don't want to, and this is if you want to. Okay, so this is actually doing the stage. If I see a shell jump, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Straight up not doing it. I hate shell jumps. I hate any stages that have to do with shell jumps. Oh yeah, that's super intuitive right there. I see the player can deduce this shit on their own. Okay, I can see why they- yeah. This is why the skip is, is available, and I'm taking it, no shame. These stages are not my thing. Never have been, never will be. This is not my idea of fun here. Also, hang on. What is this video? It's a cake or death sketch. Okay, hang on. I can watch it because it's muting the desktop audio, so... But I'm not doing this. Oh, it's six minutes long. I'll watch it later. Yeah, so that's cool. I'm not doing that. And this one is... a taste of strength test? What is this? Okay, this is shell sticker. Okay, but see, this... Seems more doable. I think. How long is the stage? Because it's not a shell jump, the thing sticks to the wall. Okay, that is probably the hardest thing to do here. And then everything else is just... Okay, that's not too bad. I can see a scenario where I can do that. What about here? Don't know what 1F8 is, so we haven't hit that stage. No. So I guess that's one less stage to worry about. I'm sorry if this is disappointing to some, but... Yeah. <laughs> I mean... Those that know me know that, yeah, those kind of stages. I always say... Nah. I have nothing to prove with that. Let's go get that Yoshi and <laughs> just cheese that stage. Um, can you get Yoshi here? I think you can. Yeah. I'm just gonna straight up get the blue one.
Wait, oh, there's a star next to Bowser's castle. That wasn't there before. Ah, uh, it's this one. Okay, and that completes. Ah. Okay. Uh, I could, yeah, I have to die. There's no. So I have to react what? I should have watched very carefully. I'm going to watch it very carefully again. I mean, okay, let's say I do the shell level. That just leaves 1F8 and then Bowser's Castle and then it's done. Yeah, it, it doesn't matter which one, really. Um, no, you know what? I'm not going to risk it. I'm going to watch... this one, right? No. It's this one. No, that says legit. Okay. We don't want legit. Human using a tool. Flying over pixel perfect. <laughs> I like the name of that video. Human uses a tool. Yep, I am human. Right, so you just move out of the way, jump, and grab right away. Okay. Immediate left, jump, grab. I am but a human. Listen, it's like, this is no different than me having to resort to a cape to complete stages. Ah! <laughs> and it's, oh shit, it's not like it's, it's in, wait, oh, I got to keep Yoshi. Wait, what do you, hey, ah! no, I don't. Because <laughs> I had him when I died. Okay, that makes sense. I guess that's kind of nice, is if I do mess it up, I don't have to keep going to get Yoshi. So it remembers if I have him. It's okay. Doesn't really matter. Just try again. Just keep trying. Eventually, it, it'll work. <laughs> it gives you a one up every time you die, so. Oh my god, okay. Just ignore the checkpoint. 
I'm nothing but a human. this. Oh. And it's just as easy as that. Totally did that legit. Record time. <laughs> okay, so... I gotta go to the other path now. Oh yeah, right, and you can... As a challenge is optional. Right, I brought a Yoshi. <laughs> I brought a Yoshi with me. I might have an attempt at it, but, you know, I'm not hell-bent on it. I will try it, at the very least. I just want to connect the map up now. One, okay, so this is one F8, which is, this is the final unlock. Whoa, 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 what is this? Oh. It's liminal spaces, okay. It wraps. Well, this one doesn't have a skip, so... Yeah, let's just leave this for now. I'll have to complete this one, but for now... Let's just come back to this one for a minute. I've already forgotten. <laughs> yeah. No, oh, no, this is... Yeah, this is... No matter how many times you watch a movie... Okay, I think... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, th I think I had it right. And then... Alright, this isn't too bad. Doesn't have to be one swift motion. Oh. Maybe it does. Shit. But I think it, it allows multiple attempts at least. I mean, this is interesting, if nothing else. Shit. Okay, no, I, I can see myself doing this. That's quite a bit of progress pretty quickly. Okay, 
kind of wish I didn't cheat myself, but oh well. Oh, see, that's an alternate way to do it. I don't think the shell matters which one. Ah! <laughs> I didn't aim up. The coins are huge help. Shit. <laughs> oh no. What what? Wait, what happened there? It's kind of nice that this stage is short, so when you do get it, it's just one smooth motion, I guess. I just thought I'd have more problems with it. As sort of shell jumping, but not really. It's like... If shell jumping were a mechanic that was designed by Nintendo, it'd probably be something like this, where there's a block that gets it stuck to the wall, and it's not something where it's just, like, a side effect of the physics. And difficult to pull off. Like, this is pretty reliable. Oh, I forgot the throw. Imagine this is low-key training for shelf jumping. Shit. I'm not that great a player. Um, I'm alright, but I'm nowhere near the level of these people that play these games. It'll take me longer. Ah! Okay, what do I do here? I have, I have to throw it, don't I? No. I need to watch the movie again. But I mean, I got up to that part on my own. I also got to see the, uh, the final unlock. Thank you. 
Okay, so let's see what I have to do. I might have to watch this a couple times. <laughs> I think once you get past that part, you're kind of home free. This is probably the most difficult thing here. Just this jump here. We have to throw it, you have to do that. Bounce throw and then land on it again. But then everything after that should be okay. Okay, watching it again. Grab blue, throw, grab green, throw. Grab, um, okay. I think, I think I got the gist of it. Okay. So this is one of eight, the stage that comes after it. Okay, so this whole thing is- it's a wrapping stage. Oh. Oh, this is gonna hurt my brain. Because those blocks kill you. It's very easy to lose track of Mario. Okay. <laughs> okay. Is it? I don't see a checkpoint in this so far. What is this? That part wasn't too bad. Oh my god. <laughs> that tra that transfer. Dude. Mm -ooh. I mean, I think this looks harder than what it is. This is definitely going to be a stage that takes me like an hour, but... I don't see anything here that is beyond my abilities. Like, this is just remembering what to do each time. At least it marks it on those ones, so that's nice. There's no way I'm going to remember this whole thing, but I'm just watching just to see what I'm up against. So, this part, it's not so much dodging, it's just standing on the right one. It's It just keeps going. Oh, that's it. Okay. Yeah, I mean... Uh... <laughs> like... I don't think the stage is bullshit. It looks cool. Just... It's, it's gonna be difficult. They showed another Mario movie trailer at the Game Awards. Definitely... I think the movie's gonna be alright. Like, it looks like it's gonna be funny. But... I just- I can't- I just can't get used to Chris Pratt's voice as Mario. Like, it just- it doesn't work. I don't know. Mm. 
Failed. Can I reset? I don't think I can. <laughs> okay, lucky. Ooh, that that move's not easy. But I did, I did get it, just didn't, didn't land back. Fuck. <laughs> oh, oh well. I like this stage, it doesn't seem to overstay its welcome. Uh oh. Is that fine? Okay, that's fine enough. <laughs> I did it wrong! <laughs> but that's in place, I guess? This could be salvageable. Oh, no, it resets it. Rip. It doesn't reset this one. I might have to look up the video for this again. I'm not gonna walk there, I'll just look up the video on YouTube, but... I'm just remembering all the steps. Um, one sec. Shellstickar. The short stage at the very least. Alright, so when you get it, you throw and then... Yeah, so it's gotta be like a... It's a one... one move thing. make it look so easy in the videos. <laughs> it's the Mario equivalent of just draw the whole owl. Oh, 
Oh, that's in a horrible spot. Damn it! Oh, that was in a good spot, ultimately, but I didn't land it. Okay, well... We'll get this. Oh. Go back. This is because it's such a short stage. Stop it. Okay. I think the leftmost coin is the marker where I need to throw it from for it to succeed. I don't know. Like if I... <laughs> if I get it anywhere else, it's not going to work. That's gonna work. Uh, no, that, 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 that's what I have to do. That's what I have to do. It just, I think it was too low. Okay, but at least I got a feel for it. So that's, that's what I have to do. It just needs to be higher. What's wrong with me? <laughs> it's wrong with me. This is definitely just muscle memory. Out of this. It's it's officially just gone. That was the best in terms of positioning. Like I couldn't I couldn't have asked for something better. God, I guess this is an al alternative. This day pad sucks. Not the Super Nintendo D-pad, but just the controller I have. I just feel like it's not letting me hold up reliably. Oh god. No, it's okay. This is one of these things that it looks deceivingly simple. Oh, 
Uh oh. It's not gonna save its position. It resets it, unfortunately. I think. Well, it's not coming back down. Oh. Yeah, no. What what happened there? Ah! You know what, at least this is fun. The stage where I kind of did a play-by-play, -play, I wasn't having fun. This is difficult, but it's enjoyable. Uh, probably not good enough, but we'll see. Oh shit, it is. I, I fucked up. I needed to do the same thing again, but one step further. I think I need to go more to the left so then it goes lower than my character. I was too far to the right. Yeah, 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 yes, yes, yes. Glitch the shell into the wall, yeah. Yeah, fuck up the run, yeah. Part is pretty lenient, like it does let you t take your time. It does let you line it up, so that that's a kindness. Check my phone. get this done. I really do. Oh, 
<laughs> My opinion of this has changed since I skipped the stage. Effectively. At the surface level, it really did look like a shell jumping stage, and that's why I was adverse to trying to finish it. But it's not really that. It's its own thing, which is, I guess, neat. Okay, that was, that was it, but I think I was too low. Or maybe I need to jump right away, I don't know. That's one more jump ahead, I guess. Oh, crap. So the second, hang on, the second time it needs to be on the green coin, more or less, and then you need to go even higher, and because once you grab, you need to jump immediately. So if you, if I don't get it on the green coins on the right, then it's not worth it. It's not going to be high enough. I'm just messing it up. Oh, come on. That last jump is going to be a doozy. Just looking at it. I mean, look at how long it's taken me to set these up. Okay, that's, that, that's perfect. Oh god. Okay. Don't fuck me! <laughs> okay, this is the critical part. That was the critical part. There's no, there's no fixing this. I wasn't facing the right way. Okay, but that's one step closer. After that jump, it's it's downhill. I knew I was gonna mess it up. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, that wasn't gonna work. But I can reposition. No. too low. I almost had it. I mean too high.
Okay. Oh god. close was I? I did bounce off it, so I want to see, like, what did I do wrong? I just want to see, give myself a visual guide as to where the shell needs to land. It needs, yeah, okay, I need to curve the jump. So that was my mistake, I hugged the wall. Okay. So I, I had it more or less correct. Brain fart, I forgot to release. a hundred lives here, aren't I? I mean, I'm pretty close. No, too low. There's no fixing it either. It has to be with the green corners or it doesn't work. Or higher. Perfect. Like right, ah! oh, I almost fell off. Excuse me. I, I, I cloned the block somehow. <laughs> I hate this. Okay. 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 You can do this. Mm. 
Not too low. It had to be higher. I did curve it, but it was too low, so. Correct angle, incorrect height. The previous time was just incorrect angle, correct height, so. Oh. And it doesn't matter because I, I keep kicking it up. I wish there was a quick reset. Other than death. I keep doing that. One jump away! I knew it, just the angle that I was coming at, it was just like, nah, it's not gonna work. Okay. I'm so close. I see the light at the end. It's just the height, it's not right. Oh shit. No. Nah. I accidentally re grabbed it. myself out. I should have just trusted my instincts. I kind of curved it because I wanted to leave the clone guides there, but it fucked me in the end. Like that one's pretty much landed as high as, well, almost as high as again. Almost. Nah. 
I mean, that was perfect, but I couldn't land it again. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh, uh, alright. I'm probably gonna have to go get more lives. I should mute myself if I'm gonna make a noise like that, but it's just so knee-jerk. Sound like a cat. I don't get another try. I got caught. <laughs> Damn it. Ugh. Unfortunate, but okay. I'm just a few jumps away from getting it. to the right. I thought I had uh, figured out how to do that consistently. I guess not. I don't like the feel of that one. <laughs> it's, it just can't. Why does it have to be that? <laughs> it just can't be straightforward. Way too low. <laughs> Why can't I get this reliably?
that's the one throw that I just seem to mess up every time consistently. The others I'd more or less have down. Ah, oh, missed. Alright, I'm gonna get more lives after this. Back in a sec. It's a fun stage, at least. just get the 99. I'm sure I'm gonna need it for whatever comes after this. So I guess there's gonna be one more stream of this by the looks of it, and then we're done. Unless I happen to finish this stage right now and then the next one lies as well. There'll be one more stream of this and then we're done. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, good. I'm not sure you could hear that through the microphone, but yeah, dickhead people in their cars. It's not even here, it's in the suburb next door, and it, it, they're just that obnoxiously loud that you can hear it here. But I guess it's Friday, so it's understandable, but sometimes they just do it at really weird times. Okay. Probably not okay. Yeah, just It was under pretty much by the amount that it was under the coin by, so that coin is there for a reason. I have to get it on it or above it. Thank you. 
that last jump, I need to see how to do it. Okay, but close. Almost. I'm watching again. What did, what did I do wrong, positioning-wise? Everything else is perfect, just... I need to jump, okay, I need to jump more ahead and turn around. I guess. I, I sort of got the mental picture. That was the best run so far, like... Everything was pretty much perfect. Just the final jump. On the bright side, it looks like I'm positioning the shell pretty well now, on that one. And now this one is eluding me, why? What's happening is I'm throwing it too late. I think this has to be like here. Too high. <laughs> I knew it already. <sighs> I'm getting closer though. Why am I messing this up? <laughs> I have this part down. At least I thought so. I 
just want I, I want to finish this. I gotta release the up button. That's my mistake. I just keep holding on to it. Ooh, that's not gonna work. Cutting it close. I may have messed this up. I need to reset it. <sighs> yeah, that block. I don't get why it appears, but it messed me up. No. Nah. Oh, no. Nah. <laughs> Definitely no now. There's one thing that I've always never been able to get the hang of since the very first Mario game is just trampoline mechanics. I'm just horrendous at them. Like, if I'm ever gonna die, it's gonna be to that in the classic Mario games. I just, want, I just want this over, like, I know I'm, I'm there. For it. I'm just gonna wait. I've clearly messed it up. This is not the end. It's the end. Wait, I've already seen this. It's fine. Alright. Legitimately done. My hands kind of hurt, but done. <laughs> now you can't say that I didn't do that. I did at least one of the 
shell mechanic stages, so I don't mind that I skipped the other. Um, yeah, I mean, we'll do a bit of this. Like, this this just looks like it's a nightmare either way, but... We might reserve it for the finale, maybe. We'll see. Oh yeah, right. Yes, yeah, this is something I gotta get used to. I gotta get into the mindset of the fact that the stage wraps like that. I didn't see any checkpoints, which is a little concerning. This might be like a one-shot, one-take thing. So, I don't know. I'm hoping that it auto-saves. There are stages that do that. Pretty unforgiving. Okay, uh, first section done. Okay, cool. Yeah, no, it saves it. Alright, this is fine. Then I, I can get on board with this. Oh, yeah, right. The yeah, I gotta remember that's the wrapping. If we're taking this one area at a time, then this is manageable. Resort to the play by play just yet. For now, I'll try and do it. Oh, even even that you can't go over the top of the jump. I just noticed there's no life counter. Does that mean I have infinite lives here, or what? Oh. Okay. Probably not, but... Let's just assume we do for now. I mean, that is another approach I can take, is just keep bouncing off it until they come down. Oh, 
Oh, that's rude. I died on purpose. This is, this is not easy, but it doesn't feel ultra tedious yet. Good job. Oh, I exited by accident. Whoops. Um, please tell me that it saves. It should, right? It does, alright, cool. Actually, let me see. How many lives do I have? Is it draining my lives? 73. Okay, let's just... I, I don't think it is. So I'll leave it for a bit and then exit the stage later. One step further. Crap, I forgot. Oh no, I got pushed. I think the hardest ones are going to be the ones that I saw with the Yoshi transfers, like those look insane. Timing as well. You can't just instantly transfer. <laughs> you dick. They got faked out. These feel like bonus stages. They seem to be pretty to themselves.
Um, yeah, see, that's... I have to do a low jump there, I'm pretty sure. Like, not as high as I'm doing right now. <laughs> I couldn't position myself onto the other one. You have to pretty much land on, on the correct platform, otherwise it's very difficult to reposition. Okay, I gotta trust in it more. A lot of these are just trust that the platform is going to be there when you land type scenarios. That one in particular, I'm jumping too early. I'm panicking. Probably too early. No, nope, got it. One at a time. impatient. for the blue. That's my... That's my marker. I made a mental note of where the platform was. I see. So I need to there. Okay. <laughs> it's not easy. This is honestly just one step at a time. The stage. There's no way you could do this without knowing what was coming up. a case of learn the stage and then you can maybe do it in one try. Okay, a bit too much. Just had to trust. 
I tried to stand still, unfortunately timing was off. Just like the previous stage, it doesn't feel frustrating. Because it's not really asking, like, some highly specific skill off me. It's just jumping and positioning. And timing, which, it's fine. down I had to I, ha I had to fall down sooner I think I needed to full. Hang on. I need to watch the middle platforms and not the one I'm on. I think that's a mistake I'm making. I'm just not watching the platforms I should be watching. was unfortunately moving. enough momentum in that jump. Double, double jump. Okay, 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 okay. I saw the door. It looks like it's a triple jump even. Just keep jumping. Treat it like a climb. I'm climbing a staircase there.
I didn't land on it. I needed to jump a third time, unfortunately. That is very strict timing on that one. I got faked out by the falling platform. trying to get up there as quick as I can because I think timing is of the essence on that one. I tried to do it in one leap, it didn't work. It has to be three. That last one, man. Ah. Okay, I got lucky there. Still worked. Need to be more to the left. More to the left. Thank you for the raid. How's it going? Yeah, for the shambles. Appreciate it a lot. How's the stream? It lets me take like a mental breather from this one. Okay. Great, good to hear. What were you up to? Aww. 
Jeopardy? Okay, fair enough. Did you catch any of the uh, video game award stuff? Oh, I went too early. I jumped too high, damn it. You heard God of War lost it, that's it. Yeah, Elden Ring won Game of the Year. I was surprised that God of War was up for it, given that it only just came out. I feel like there wasn't enough time to judge it. But at least uh, the voice actor for Kratos won an award. I think it was best voice or something like that. They did announce a few new games. He deserves it. Yeah, he's a really good voice actor, that guy. Was really happy to get the award, but... His speech did go for a while to the point where they had to play him off. But I think he was just excited. What have I done? I'm not focusing. <laughs> Pay attention to what I was doing. Yeah, I mean, I, I think it's worth a watch just to see some of the new stuff that was announced, or at least a wrap up. Because there was quite a bit. They showed a bit more of the Mario movie as well. Still, yeah, I mean, Chris Pratt. <laughs> I just, I can't listen to his voice as Mario, it just doesn't sound right. I should have just called it quits when I finished the previous stage. Part is a doozy. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. That feels like it's way harder than it needs to be. I 
I feel like I've got this down. It's just this part here. No, too high. <laughs> if I can't get in the next five goes, I'll take a look at the footage that they have for the stage. I'll see where I'm going wrong. Thankfully, they do have a replay here. It's definitely a case of you have to catch the falling platform, I'm just not sure. Sam Hopkins, Jeopardy, who's Sam Hopkins? See, I'm not attuned to that. You just type your Google search. <laughs> I mean, fair enough. Pretty innocent Google search. Just be glad you weren't doing anything inconspicuous. Still dorky, it is. How about this? Okay, Google, Sam Hopkins Jeopardy. Hey, Alexa, Sam Hopkins Jeopardy. Uh, I'm sorry. Is it Hey Alexa, or is it something else? Sorry if that set, set off anyone's device, but you know. You'll note that the one that I didn't say is the phone that I have, because I didn't want my phone to start looking for that. <laughs> Crap. Okay, pay attention! I must try to get this section done. So, what did this uh, Sam Hopkins do? To warrant the Google search, aside from being cute. Did he win? He won two shows, okay, so smart as well. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go watch the movie. Just for this last part. At least it doesn't eat away your life, so that's nice. In another universe, Australia would have gotten Jeopardy, but instead of Jeopardy, we got this program that wasn't as good and it just, I don't know, there was something about it that was just boring. Very similar to Jeopardy, but just without the flair. It was called Sail of the Century. And the vibes of it, the best way I can describe it is just like... If you've ever seen Office Space, it just feels like the Office from Office Space, but in game show form. Just very stuffy and just boring.
And I know this because... They used to do tours of the TV station for elementary schools, and they would get elementary schools to sit in the audience of this TV show being filmed. Because they couldn't fill the audience normally. Oh, it's the wrong one. So that's what we got instead of Jeopardy. Which one is that? Is it this one? It might be this one. Okay. So this is the part that I've done. And it was totally as impressive as this. <laughs> you know, when I see that, that's not impressive at all, anyway. Okay, so this is what I'm up to. I mean, more or less what I've been doing. Wait, what? Wait, what? Whatever, wait. What do you mean? What do you mean? Where did that platform from the left come from? I did not see that once, or was I that blindsided to it? I have to say that again. What do you mean? It would be this one. I think you have to keep it on screen. Okay. Alright, I, I think I can remember that. I'm just glad that does this. Oh, you know what? While I'm here, I should save, so I have that checkpoint saved at least. I get this done, then that just leaves one more stage and one more stream of this, and I'm done with this. I'm not gonna play another difficult game for at least three months. Lost the rhythm.
It's so hard this stage is just because of stuff falling from the top layer. It just fakes me out sometimes. Ah. Oh. I see the platform at the bottom. So it's more more or less that. <laughs> hey Sabine, thank you for the raid. How's it going, dude? I'm down to two stages now, so I'm nearly done with this. <laughs> Some things that don't change, like stuff that used to get me as a kid, get me in this. Not that I ever played anything this difficult as a kid, but there were stages in Mega Man that sort of had these kind of mechanics in it where you would fall through the ceiling and then it would loop you. Just anything that has that sort of thing, like a trampoline or reverse gravity, my brain just struggles a little. Or if it's Hammer Brothers, ugh. I'm an adult and Hammer Brothers still terrify the crap out of me. How do I do this better? I'm doing it slower than before. I, I had the pace incorrect. But I seem to be a little bit behind now. That one that falls down, it fakes me out because I think that's the one I need to land on, and it's not. It's so evil. It's done on purpose. Ah. 
Oh. I'm just going to magically get this one run. Like, it's, it's just one of these things. I know what needs to be done. I just need to do it. You can't high jump, you have to. Okay, that that was it. Just no, let's not hit the ceiling, that's all. That's all. If I don't hit the ceiling, I got it. I have to spin jump through it, because that's a lower jump. jump early. If I jump too late, it, it puts you too close to the ceiling. Even that wouldn't have made it. Okay, so that's a timing thing. like you recognize the song. It's used in other stages, but I'm not sure what game it's from. Is it from Chrono Trigger? I don't think so. I feel like I would recognize it if it was from Chrono Trigger, but it might be. There's a lot of songs in this where I recognize it, but I can't put my finger on it. I mean, you can probably find out. I think the game's soundtrack is listed somewhere. Okay, something like that. Just need it to wait like one more second. It's something like that. up my positionings couldn't recover oh. it's so hard sometimes running back from those platforms just trying not to overdo it Last jump.
I don't think I can learn anything from watching it again. Other than you need to make that jump. You need to thread the needle. Maybe I can get... Like a, uh, a mental picture of when I should jump. Okay, hang on. So I'm not going constantly back and forth to see the movie. I'm just going to look it up on YouTube. Uh, what is the name of the stage? It's called like 1-2-F-A or something like that. the end. 1F8. It's close. Um, okay, so I'm just trying to get like a... an indication of when I should jump, more or less. To the point where I'm, I'm gonna leave the freeze frame on the screen so then I can refer to it. As I don't want to be here for two hours. Okay, uh, let's see that again. Okay. Kind of got a visual marker. It looks like it's, you have to ride it to the top of the arc and then you just spin jump across the thing. So it can't be early, it has to be a spin jump. I think a normal jump would be way too difficult to control it. Damn it. I'm not sure I can control the height that easily. Falling platform every time. This is why I suck at rhythm games, by the way. This is why I will never play rhythm games seriously. Because just this impatience, waiting for something to get precise timing to press a button, I just, I can't do it. What's well, it? So, hey, sir, thank you for the 32 months, dude. How's it going? Thirty-two months, that's a lot. That's why you play fast songs that are hard. <sighs> but my- I don't know, my brain just can't compute. I would embarrass myself. Have you- I've played rhythm games on stream a couple times. And just- if you ask any other regulars, they just always find it hilarious just how bad I am. And it just devolves me into making grunting sounds when I mess up. So... There was a game called Melatonin that's got a pretty cool art style that I tried. Um, I tried to play that. I did okay in the end, but it was horrible. <laughs> I didn't hit the ceiling, I just didn't make it. Um, you're just chilling, how am I? I'm doing great. Today was my last day of work for the year. So whilst I'm tired because I had to get a bunch of stuff done, uh, my year is done work-wise, so... 
Yeah, that was almost it. That was almost it. I mean, in hindsight, I probably should have played this tomorrow instead when I was rested, but... Yeah. What can you do? Gotta get to bed. No worries, Evie. Get some rest. Thank you for the raid again. Hope your Google search was uh, fruitful. <laughs> that must have been trippy when I read that out. Would have been like, wait, how the fuck did he know what I was searching? Oh, come on. I have to get this. Just please, in, in, the, in the next five minutes, let me get this. Do I have any grand plans? Um, not really, aside from just family stuff. Just gonna be taking it easy. Ah, not enough momentum. I know what I won't be doing. I won't be playing difficult games. <laughs> Once this is done, that's it. So glad they didn't announce a new Crash Bandicoot game today. I was so worried for a sec that I would have to play another difficult game. Yeah, got it! <laughs> Alright! Oh, what fresh hell is this? What do, you, what do you mean? Okay, that, that, that's not it either. The new Hades game looks cool. It's it's cool looking, yeah. Um, I'm kind of glad it wasn't just a DLC, because now they're probably going to tell a story that's just as big as the original. Um, so yeah, the voice acting and music and everything in Hades is just amazing. So to get more of that, I'm on board. It'll be a while, I mean, a couple of years, so... But it's nice to know that it's coming. Oh, this one's very specific. I'm just glad that this doesn't eat up lives, that you can just keep reattempting it. Great. It makes it less tedious. So this one's gonna be a doozy. I 
I think the issue here is going to be is what do I need to do immediately after this? It's like one, two, and then on the third one, jump by the looks of it. One, two, three. No. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> I wasn't ready. Ah. Uh, okay. 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 How can anyone possibly do this without knowing what's coming up? Like, can anyone realistically do this first try? There's no way. I, I don't believe anyone has ever done this first try. It just relies a lot on knowing what's coming up. No. <sighs> it looks like this section's pretty short though, which is nice. I'm trying to get some some marker to let me know, like, I jump now. That's what I'm trying to figure out right now. Like an indicator. All games or something else, difficulty-wise. I mean, does does this count as an old game? It's it's a ROM hack that was done in the 2010s. But I mean, the statement is true. <laughs> Can you imagine if this was actually in Super Mario World? Oh man, that'd be funny. Like, Miyamoto just got violently drunk one night. Just out of spite, just put this level in. Dwarf Fortress out on Steam has you interested in the POE League. I did purchase Dwarf Fortress. I have intention of trying it, just not sure when. Man, that is, ugh, that is very specific. But the mechanics are hard too. It is true. But it's one of those things that anyone can pick it up and figure it out. It's pretty intuitive. I've been playing the, uh... I mean, I guess I can call it a remake. But it's not official. It's a remake of Zelda 2. And that's been a lot of fun. Because it's just... Enhanced the mechanics of the original. And expanded the content by quite a bit. But admittedly, some parts of that, yeah. They're definitely ROM hack tricky. This is really hard.
Yeah, that's one thing, Seth, that put me off about Dwarf Fortress. I know it doesn't sound great, but just the text-based graphics just of the original Dwarf Fortress, but I get why. Um, I guess I just never played text-based games growing up, so... And because you have to manage a lot of stuff, it just, it just, to me, it feels cumbersome. That's no comment on the gameplay or anything, it's just not my thing. Shit, I accidentally won't exit. It's okay, I'll just re-enter the stage. But, I mean, it does seem like something that I would enjoy, so I, I did pick it up. You know, it supports the devs. I mean, they deserve the support, given how long that game was free for. It's like four times micromanagement minus the pretty graphics. Yeah. Exactly. That's more or less how I feel about it. You have to... You have to keep track of... Wait, what does this mean again? <laughs> I mean, I'm sure once you think hundreds upon hundreds of hours into it, yeah. You don't think about that stuff anymore, but as a barrier to entry for me, it's definitely something. How the heck did I do that the first time? I'll check it out. I've just never been good at micromanagement games, but... At the very least, those ones that are, I guess, a little more chill. And even if I do horribly, it's funny. I'm okay with those. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm okay if, uh... Everyone dies. Oh, it's stanch or something. I thought you were talking about four times the micromanagement. I didn't know it was a genre. <laughs> I just thought you meant like it takes more effort to micromanage because of the lack of uh, pretty graphics. But yeah, I get it. Okay. <laughs> just a little bit further. So they called it 4X instead of 4E. But see, I don't mind when there's a lot of micro and then it falls apart for me, but the result is funny. Not so much when the game has a serious undertone. That's when it's not fun for me. One, it's something like, uh, just, like, fecal matter everywhere, like RimWorld, or <laughs> just people dying of random diseases, or wild animals attacking them, I don't know, it's funny. I can laugh at how bad it's gone. I'm not making much progress on this one. That's the charm of colony management games, they're pretty wild. Yeah, exactly. Like, I have to be in the mood for them, but I do play them. I just know that, for me, from a streaming perspective, you're not gonna watch because I'm good at it. <laughs> you're gonna watch because, inevitably, Something's going to happen that's going to tilt me, and it's going to be funny. Uh, 
Like a rim world, everything was going well for me, and then just this one invasion just fucked the whole thing and in a pretty irreversible way. And that was it, that's all it took. It was funny. Um, I might have to see what I need to do for this bullet bill part. It's okay because I would have done it anyway with the movie. I still can't believe RimWorld got banned in Australia. Like, I, I thought we were past banning games. Oh, you can just do that? Okay. <sighs> Seriously? Yeah, it did. I mean, heaven forbid kids play games that are intended for adults. You thought it got unbanned. Uh, I haven't been following the news on it. Maybe it has gotten unbanned. But I know, yeah, it did get banned. I purchased it before it got banned originally, so if it's been unbanned since, I wouldn't know of it because I've always owned it. There used to be a huge problem here, and then we finally got an adult rating system, and I thought that would be the end of it. But nope. Still happens. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna see what I need to do here, because it just doesn't seem crystal clear what I need to do for the bullet bill part. So hang on, I'm watching it. You just need to bounce- you just need to run forward and bounce off it. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Hey, Laura, how's it going? Oh! No. Wait, it reminds of an irresponsible dad who let their kid play Deep Rock until they started repeating quotes from it and got into trouble with their spouse. <sighs> yeah. I mean... At the end of the day, uh, I don't know. I know this is an unpopular opinion in the general public. At the end of the day, like, it's up to you to see what your kids are doing and, you know, parent, right? That's not to say you'll be able to control everything they see and consume from a media perspective. Kids find a way, like, I mean... My parents hated South Park as a concept, right? But they, they did their best to prevent us from watching it, but at the end of the day, like, we'd still... We're exposed to it. There's nothing really you can do. And this was before the age of the internet, right? Like... I don't know. To impose that the rest of society... ...heed to the fact that you have children and don't really want to do... ...due diligence, I don't know. I've never been into that. I mean, I've talked about this before, but like... That rabbit hole that's popped up recently that, um, was all the- all this cursed video content on YouTube that rose as a result of parents just putting autoplay on their iPad on YouTube. So, yeah, I don't know, man. You have two kids and your responsibility to filter content. Yeah. I mean, it would be the equivalent of, like, if a child happened to get behind the wheel, the wheel of a car because of negligence, and then the parents like, we need to ban all vehicles. Vehicles need to have, like, this feature that doesn't let you start the car unless you enter a password or do a bunch of, like, six steps to unlock the car. It's like, oh, how about, you know, you make sure that uh, you're watching your kid. I don't know. And that's a very straw man example, but sometimes you have to use those too. To kind of illustrate how ridiculous it is.
I know people are going to disagree with me on that, but yeah. Oh, what? Okay, cool. So that's that's a what? What do I do there? Uh, um, I got the video here. Spin, you have to spin jump onto that and then go across. Okay, that was the end of that section. I just needed to make that. So this is not too bad. Gotta go get groceries. Take care, thanks for the stream and chat. No worries, Sinzare. Appreciate the pop in and the chat as well. Enjoy the rest of your day. I got this. Oh, thanks for the follow, appreciate it. Oh, okay. I think I got this. I think I got this. I wonder how many steps are left. Oh. So close. I don't know, man, like, in terms of things that are harmful for kids, I would argue the loot box stuff in games like Fortnite is way more harmful than themes about drugs and alcohol and sex. That might, that might be a hot take, but uh, I don't know. I feel like that's more of an evil. I'm not saying the others are necessarily good for kids, but I feel like... If there's one thing that should probably be policed more than, say, I don't know, a child getting their hands on an adult game, is a child's game having gambling, more or less. Your nine-year-old has been asking to be allowed on Fortnite. Not a hope in hell of that one happening. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's fair. I think one thing Epic is doing, though, to, because there are a lot of parents that aren't letting their kids play Fortnite, they have the... the I remember reading they're going to introduce these sandboxed accounts that you can create for your kids, and then those will have all that kind of content hidden from the kids. So I guess that's a positive step. But not every company is doing that. <laughs> Don't get you started on loot boxes. I'm sorry. This is yeah. There's always a focus on the wrong thing. I'm so close. Uh, three more seconds of survival and then I have it. Ugh. The stage from start to finish is only two minutes long. <laughs> Can you believe that? Okay. 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 See, when Will starts making funny noises, that's when you know he's tired. Crap.
Alright, I'll tell you something. I have a younger cousin who, for a little while, was a little annoyed at me and my brother. So, what happened... It's kind of sad, it's kind of sad, but I didn't know it was going to happen. Um, when he was a kid, he was able to, I don't think he tricked them, but he was able to get a copy of GTA and then he was talking about it one day at a family party, just that he was playing GTA. And then me and my brother were kind of like, wow, kind of surprised you get to play GTA. That'd be the kind of game that, like, our parents wouldn't never let us play. And I think my aunt overheard, and the next time he was just angry at us and continued to be angry at us for a long time. Because ap apparently the moment they got home, <laughs> mom took the disc and broke it. And that's, that's, that's heartbreaking for a child, but, like, it's, it's kind of funny. I don't know. He shouldn't have been playing it in the first place. I'm talking about a kid that's, like, seven, right? Like... But just how long he kind of held a grudge over it. I mean, I probably would have, too, if I was his age. But we didn't realize that that was going to be the end result. You know, we were just talking and they happened to overhear. What is this? Oh! Oh. Ugh. Oh, this is not good. Okay, I see. I have to bounce off these things. Um, okay. Uf upon first impression, I was like, oh, this doesn't look that chaotic. But this is probably worse. I would have just had to go through. What if I have to skip this one and jump to the next one right away? Ah! Oh! <laughs> okay, okay. Just gotta trust in the heart of the cards. How did I- how did I do that? Dude. That was kind of impressive. The fact that I chained that. Um, I may have to watch this one. This one- This is, all, this is all about very specific positioning. <laughs> okay, I, I'm gonna watch this. So skip the first one, bounce up the second, bounce up the third. Okay, wow, that was really quick, what they did. That third jump? What is it? I can't even tell what they do for that third jump. It looks like it's fall and land. Okay, I'll, I'll try. Oh my god, it's already 11 o'clock at night, jeez. I wasn't expecting this to go this long. I lost track of time, admittedly. Can't seem to get this right. Too short. 
I think this one's definitely the hardest one so far. This is very specific. Nah. Okay, almost. 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 Okay. I just need to control the jumping a bit better. Is it a loop track? Holy crap, that that one there just disorients me so much. I nearly had it. That was that was it. That was it. I just messed up the last one. Barely messed it up. I almost had it. That was, that was so close. No. Nah. I got this. I appreciate that this has infinite lives and quick re retry. <sighs> Dude, that that part there with the fish, I always look at, lose track of Mario. Like at that point, I'm sort of trying to aim with the camera, if that makes sense, because I know Mario is going to be in the middle of it. It'll just magically happen. No! Oh, no! Too far! Too far! Oh. It's almost it. I just have to control that last one. Yeah, no! Oh. <laughs> so close! Got it! Oh, okay. What is this? Okay. Dude. Oh god. <sighs> this is gonna this is gonna be tricky too. Um, okay, apparently my head hit a ceiling. Oh, 
wait, what? Oh. I see what's happening. Oh, that is, that is messed up. I have to get ahead of it. Okay. <laughs> kind of... Kind of what I have to do. I think I have to land on it again. To fight the transfer. Why am I still doing this? I should have split this up. That is such a tall order. The problem is I, I, I can't do this straight. Hang on, I need to watch. I need to watch how this is done. They're gonna make it look easy. Yep. So they make it look extremely easy. To no surprise. <laughs> I don't... They just throw it up so perfectly. Yoshi has no horizontal momentum. I may have to split this up, chat. It's, it's almost midnight. This one seems to be really, really difficult. We're, at, we're halfway through the stage, so... Oh my god, I did it. And it's a it's a double transfer right away. That's so that is so rude. Ah. Why am I getting this all of a sudden? <laughs> like... <laughs> Suddenly it's making sense? Why? I'm catching him. Five more tries. Okay. Th that doesn't count. That one was bad. And then I have to bounce. Okay. I mean... Ah! 
Ah, oh, too far. <laughs> Come on. Oh shit. Oh, oh nearly. Yoshi, please! <laughs> Go down normally. I'm starting to ha get the hang of the transfer. Like it's not as bad as I thought it, it I think the key to it is you just gotta make sure Mario is almost stationary when you do it. And then that ensures the catch, otherwise that happens. So more or less I got the hang of it. I need, to, I need to let that one drop. It looks like it. Too high. As I'm playing this, I'll wrap up the stream as I think I'm done. But I want to thank you all for watching. If you're new to the stream and you want to know when I go live, following is a good idea. I'll be doing more of this tomorrow. Um, there's also two channels, no, three channels now on YouTube. One for VODs, one for highlights, and another one where shorts are going up on them. I've been trying YouTube streaming out a little, so... I'll be doing Zelda 2 over there tomorrow, and I'll probably do a bit more of this here before then, so that's the plan for tomorrow. Um, and then Sunday I'll probably do Terraria, so that's what I'm gonna do. But yeah, otherwise, appreciate you all for... <laughs> I don't know, I always get self-conscious when I play this game, just... Me hitting my head against the brick wall over and over for hours on end. Uh, I feel like it's not entertaining, but then again, I guess people wouldn't be here if that wasn't the case, so... Eh. Appreciate people hanging out. Uh, yeah, so that's the wrap-up to the stream, but I'm not done-done. Just doing that as... I want one more, one more fair attempt at the platform part. The, the part that's just immediately after this. And then I'll be content. <laughs> so, just gotta get rid of that stubbornness. Um, I am on break now, so I don't know how that's gonna affect the stream schedule, as yeah, I, I don't have to go to work until next year now, so I might squeeze in some stuff during the day. We'll see. I have no solid plans on that. But there's a bunch of stuff I want to check out. Including the traditional childhood retro game over Christmas. And, I mean, I'll be doing some Stardew Valley as well. Because that's usually the Christmas game. That's a nice way to unwind and chill. 
Except this time I'm gonna check out mods, which I've never done before, so... It'll be different. Enough. Damn it. I'm just not gonna get that opportunity, am I? I do gotta set some time aside as well to make more content on YouTube. <laughs> like, prepare shots and whatnot and thumbnails. It's a bit of a hassle, but I gotta do it. I gotta decide what movie I'm gonna watch as well, because doing a Christmas movie is. as tradition. Generally, it's something that was on TV when I was a kid. <laughs> That's not fair. Okay, I have to stand further back. This is so particular. Come on, one more, 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 one more. Uno mas. Damn it, I caught him, but I hit the ceiling. I think I got uh, a mental mark where I need to release Yoshi to make it every time. Just a little too high. But it almost worked. This is a testament to how stubborn I am. I just can't let things go sometimes. Particularly if I can believe or see a... Sl a scenario where I win, like I know I'm capable of this. And particularly when it doesn't help that the visuals to this game is a game I grew up with, so my inner child is just screaming like, No, you can do this, what do you mean? When the difficulty ceiling is just on another level. I saw, I tried. Yeah, look, okay. I, I watched the next part and it's kind of depressing how difficult it is. But I saw what I need to do to succeed there. So I'll tell you what, I'll just do it and then you can see what I mean by depressing. Final attempt. No, no more. Final attempt. I did it too early, but you have to jump and then release Yoshi and then land on it again and then the platform. Yeah, it's just... Okay, let me go save. But I've done the stream wrap up and the whole spiel, so I don't have to say it again. I just have to summarize. This was fun. There's only... It's just that stage and then the final Bowser Castle, so we're halfway through this stage. We'll do the other half next time and go do Bowser Castle. We're at the end of this, so it's been quite the journey. I'm pretty sure everything is saved, but just in case. Let me hear the sound. Okay, it is saved now. And yeah, that's it from me, chat. Thank you again for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed the stream, and again, the plan this weekend We'll be doing the remake of Zelda 2 tomorrow on YouTube, so 
you want to know where that is, just check out uh, the links below in the chat or go to shambles.gg. Or you can just look for Tilda Shambles on YouTube. It'll pop up. Um, we'll be doing that tomorrow. And we'll be doing more of this tomorrow at some point as well. So here on Twitch. And then Terraria on Sunday. That's the plan for now. Beyond that, I'll, I'll see. I might take the first day of the holidays just to kind of get acclimated to not working. <laughs> Should be good. But anyway, I'm done talking. Thank you so much for watching. Appreciate you all. Enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs>